In our previous video, we introduced the autumn leaf problem and how the steel-on-steel -steel contact between track and train makes wheels slip easily. Our trimometer is the unique solution that provides better traction for all trains in the network, no matter how slippery it gets. Trains have powerful engines to propel their enormous mass forward. If we start from standstill, too much power will only cause the wheels to slip and the train won't move. Similarly, a train should not hit the brakes full on in every situation. Wheels could lock, dangerously increasing the stopping distance and causing extra maintenance. To illustrate, when biking on ice, who is faster? Person A, who creates a lot of wheel slip by pedaling at full power, or person B, driving efficiently by avoiding wheel slip? Similarly, for trains, the optimal driving style is influenced by the slipperiness of the tracks. This slipperiness is defined by mu. A lower mu, meaning it is more slippery. LPS is the first in being able to measure this mu on a moving train, allowing train drivers to drive safer and faster. The data is shared with all drivers in the network, creating a map of slipperiness which is updated every time a train with trabometer passes. Now, all drivers in the network know how to drive optimally. Without knowing the mu, slipperiness can cause slipping and blocking wheels, resulting in flat spots and railway damage. The trabometer gets rid of unnecessary maintenance. By optimizing the driving style, trains hit their cruising speed earlier and combined with more efficient braking, this greatly increases punctuality, energy efficiency and safety. Faster trains also implies the same amount of trains can carry more people, increasing fleet capacity. So, trains become faster, more punctual, which increases capacity while increasing energy efficiency and decreasing maintenance by using the LPS tribometer.